Hey people, Zark Swamp here, and welcome to episode 53, I believe, of Dagonrapa V3. Last time, we went to the, this virtual world that Mew helped, that Mew modified. Yeah, that's right, we're in a world that Mew pretty much had a hand in creating. God help us all. Anyways, let's talk to her and figure out what uh, rules this. Um, so, what do you have to tell us, Mew? Sure. Well, it's not that big a deal, but there is a special rule to this world. Objects here are unbreakable. Huh? <laughs> Objects that don't break? Yeah. Like I said, Mew, there's no weapons here. Look at all these floorboards! These are potential seesaws! Cur this would be Correcchio's he heaven. Actually, no, it wouldn't be his heaven because sister's not there. I just don't no. break. In the visual world, there are no rules that govern whether objects can break. So when any object, no matter what it is, can never be broken. For example, if you stretch a rubber band far enough, it'll eventually tear, you know? But here, the rubber band wouldn't stop stretching. At a certain point, just not tear at all. Well, for some reason, your avatars can't get injured. You'll still feel pain, though. See, I told you it's not a big deal. Hey! What are you talking about? This is a really big deal. You're gonna tell us stuff like that before. Sorry, but but that's only the only special thing. In every other sense, the physics here are the same. Oh wait, that's right. There's special things about your avatars too. Don't lie. There's still more spinning out already. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And what's special about these avatars? Um. To make things fair, everyone's avatar in this world has the same average physical strength. So wait, you're doing our strength on average with Ganta. Literally, that's just gonna boost everyone up. Here gonna be able to lift dressers and just throw things. Which means Does that mean there is no discernible difference in our physical abilities? What did you say? So in this virtual So in this virtual world, I'm just as strong as Ganta. No way. What? Ganta weaker? That's also because of Himiko's magic? No, no, Ganta not strong. Ganta no can protect everyone. It's not my fault, that's just how the world is. Um, Are those the only things different about this world, Mew? Mm. Yeah, that's everything. By the way. How long... How do we log out of this world? My thoughts exactly, Kokiji. I asked that last before we even went in the world. Ah. Uh, oh yeah, that's right, I need to tell you that. If you ever want to log out, you just need to use that phone over there. Just pick you up and say your name. That's it. That's it well enough for you crap hits. Also, that phone is fixed, so it can't be removed from that room. Which means you have to use this phone to log in and out. Whenever you log in, you always appear in this room. Mm -hmm. Okay, got it. You get it? You guys better not cheat by logging out alone. We have to find the secret of the outside world. Yo, yeah, we got. So where's this map? Ah. The map is located on the wall outside this room. Follow me. This is cool. Let's talk to Samugi. Let's see her thoughts on this matter. Uh, Objects won't break. I'm missing a universe, but I feel like this is going to be a problem. Yumiko, you're getting okay. sassy. Oh yeah, I forgot to say something really important. Unfortunately, it seems like I can't use my magic here. So don't rely on me like usual, okay? I don't recall ever relying on you in the past. See? You guys are not cheat by logging out here alone. We have to learn the secret of this world. And Naki, I'm not as strong in this world. I'm guessing it's a program like that for the killing game simulator. They want to see what kind of killing game it will be when no one has their special talents. That's probably the reason. There's the map. That being said. Look, there's a map I prepared for you guys. Study and you'll know the virtual world like Sumugi knows the back. <coughs> uh, sorry about that, my throat gave out. Study and you'll know the virtual world like Sumugi knows the back of her neck. Huh? What? Ah, what about the back of my neck? How do you know that spot? Sensitive. Okay. Uh, okay, I see. The back of your neck, huh? Weirdo. Why are you so interested in that? You're gross. Jealous, Maki. There are two masks here. One big and one small. I'll look at the latter. The small map's probably for this room. For this floor area. This map has mansion written on it. You know. This is the map up to the mansion, which is the building we're in right now. This area is the entrance hall, and that room where the phone is is the salon. The hall, kitchen, and bathrooms are also on the first floor. 
there's no second floor, but I do see a rooftop area. Hmm. A rooftop, huh? I guess that'd give us a good view. Let's go check it out later. Okay. Yeah, good idea. Before I do that, I should look at the big map as well. This is probably for the surrounding area. Yep. It looks like a map to this entire virtual world. Piece of shit. Listen up, crapheads. Make sure you remember everything about this world. Uh, it looks pretty expansive. It even continues past the river. Is this an ellipsis here? Showing that it continues? Uh. Yeah, I'll tell you about what that sign means later. But you'll understand once you actually go there. What could she mean by that? Uh. Ah, there's another building here. Sure. Yeah, it's just a dinky chapel. It was a cluttered mess in here. A lot of stuff, a, a lot of stuff, huh? Maybe the secret of the outside world is hidden in there. Maybe, oh sorry, maybe the secret of the outside world is hidden in there. By the way. Oh, I just noticed, there are black lines on the, around the world map. But does that mean something? <laughs> hey, how nice of you to notice. Of course it means something. This black line represents a wall. Huh? A wall? Probably the boundaries of where the world is. Booyah! So yeah, the virtual world is actually surrounded by a huge ass wall. Survive our wall? Are we trapped even in this world? You know. No, no, you're not trapped here. Beyond that wall is the end of the world, literally. Past that wall, nothing exists. Everything ends there. Which means... I see. So that wall is the end of the world. By the way, Mew, you prepared these maps yourself. Not Monokuma, right? <laughs> Th that's right, I prepared the maps. What about it? No, it's nothing. I just wanted to know. What? There's something off about Mew's response. <laughs> We should be focusing more on more important issues now. Jeez. Yeah, where in this world the hidden the, uh, where in this world the secret of the outside world is hidden? But it's not but it's gonna be pretty hard to find something when we have no clue what we're looking for. Got a minute? Where do you think you're going? Mm -hmm. Hmm? I was going to go investigate alone. There's a lot of interesting stuff I want to check out. What? Uh, hey, like what well, hell I'm gonna let you do whatever you want. Mm -hmm. Whatever I want! No way! And what? Why do I need your permission, Kaido? I'm free to do whatever I want! You're not Karumi! You're not my mommy! I'm going, no matter what you guys say! Well, it'd be a hassle if someone kept watch over me. Ah. Keep, kept watch? Allow go Ganta not understand what's going on. Ganta not sure how helpful he can be. But Ganta can watch Kokichi so he not do anything weird. <laughs> Ganta, you're so sweet, but I knew you'd say that. You without your ridiculous physical strength, as long as you're selfless and courageous. You'd make a terrific bodyguard! Bodyguard? With you by my side, I know I'll be safe from any trap! Okay, okay then, let's go! Wait! Oh wait, Kokichi! It's okay. It's okay, leave it to Gonta. Gonta keep eye on Kokichi! What? The bodyguard? You mean Gonta? Oh yeah. It seems he planned this all along. Jeez. Jeez, he really knows how to manipulate people. Well, whatever, let's go check out the rooftop. Alright, follow me. If you want to peek up my skirt while you're at it, go for it. I want to check out the rooms. It's the it's the bathroom. Do I have to go to the bathroom? Yes, they do. It's normal toilet paper. I don't see anything suspicious about it. But in a world where nothing breaks, does toilet paper not tear either? Do I have to use the bathroom? If so, if this is an important question. I think this falls into the line of, do robots have dicks? Clock? What's this? A certain clock. Is this Mew's taste? No, it can't be. This world was originally created by Monokuma. I should check the roof. Yeah, I'm running up the stairs. No, there's snow here. Couldn't give us a tropical paradise like Jabberwock Isle. No, you had to give us some tundra. Whoa, it's snow! Look, Mocky Roll, it's snow! Look, snow! Are you a dog? It, is it cold here? Our avatars can feel cold? Sure. Yep, isn't it great? Not only can you feel cold, but you can even feel pain and pleasure too. In fact, you don't even need to use birth control here. Hey, try to be quiet, please. I feel like the more you talk, the more I dislike you. Samugi, you're like, are you really my one friend in disguise? I swear. That's right. 
How about we start by exploring the rooftop? Okay. Yeah, let's do this. There's roof. There's a, a pair of binoculars. Let's check that out. My binoculars. <laughs> Man, looks like you got a lot of experience with binoculars. Haha, <laughs> you're such an obvious peeping Tom. I have a lot of experience with binoculars. What does that mean? You can see pretty far with these nine binoculars. I mean, duh, they're binoculars. Feel free to look around them. Get a good look at everything. Trees, road, river. How the binoculars didn't see past here? Ah, is this where the line on the map was? You know. I told you it's not a line. Then, then what is it? Why did the binoculars stop there? Yeah, aggressive men are always coming, going, and coming too soon. I'll explain to you when we get there, so you don't get your pennies in a bind. What are you talking about? What could be over there? This looks like a storage room. I suppose I should check inside. It doesn't seem as though there's anything of interest here. In, in that case... I rewrote the program to delete all dangerous objects that could be used as weapons. Well, I don't see anything dangerous that could be used as a weapon. And besides, this is similar, right? We act won't actually die, right? You know you'll just go into a coma. That only... That only Izuru Kamakura can wake you up from. Perhaps because of all the weapons were deleted, the shelves are empty. The only thing here is an empty box and some lattice. Rolled up carpet, huh? It does look safe. Can we leave? Because really, come on. Oh, what? Oh, darn it! Okay, sorry. Well, did you manage to examine all of the places that caught your eye? Yeah, but there weren't too many points of interest. Ah, it's really cold! I didn't think it'd be snowing! <laughs> no, I see me cooked. That means if you trip and sit your head, it won't hurt. Don't be rude. I'm not the type to trip that often. Aw, poor Himiko. That's way too cliche to gag. Jeez. I curiosity, do the... Oh, no, they just keep him neutral. Snow in a mansion. How ominous. Great job, Killer Game Simulator. But you know. But we're not leaving any footprints in it. What's up with that? That's true. That's probably a program like that. It'd be easy to find the culprit from the footprints. Ah. Yeah, look at look that way. But you don't need to worry about it. This is just a simulation. There's no dangerous items here whatsoever. Let's go outside. We can cross the river and head to the chapel. No. But how do we cross the river? I don't remember seeing any bridges. <laughs> yeah, so effing stupid. You're approaching Savanta territory. Let's just go over there so I can explain to you idiots all at once. Oh, sorry. Kibo, is something wrong? Okay. Did I miss a Kibo line? Oh, no, good, yeah, I did. Kibo, is something wrong? Well... Well, I was just looking at that wall and I started to think about what Miu said. About how nothing exists beyond that wall. And then I started to think about the wall that surrounds the academy. Oh no, never mind. Forget what I just said. What, that we could potentially be in a simulator? And that we're in a simulator in a simulator? Well then. Some, pulling some Rick and Morty... Some Rick and Morty stuff? We should get going. If we're late, Mew will chew us out with vulgar profanities. Running with the B button at the speed of sound. Running like a guy who knows it down. I don't know. Come on, let's go. Let's check around. You know, there's always time for exploration. What this? No. Is this the secret of the outside world? You earned one mana coin. Hmm. Something shiny. You earned three mana coins. Cool. I like exploring. And yeah, going to the river. Okay, running, 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 running at the speed of sound. Mirai Hills. Mm -hmm. 
There's no bridge after all. How are we supposed to cross the river now? As you know, my magic doesn't work in this world. Well... Don't tell me. Do we have to swim? Yeah. Fine, I won't tell you. Besides, you can't go in the river in the virtual world. Huh? Then, should we use something as a boat? Fucking Jeez, you're not even trying to hide your stupidity. The river's current's too fast. A boat will just get swept away easy. But... So we need a bridge then! Listen up! I told you, we already got a bridge! There's a wider river downstream that connects to this one. Next up, there's a long sidewalk that says Mirai Hills. Apparently, it was meant for the mansion, but we can use it as a makeshift bridge. You well, then. Wait, you spent all this time on the program, yet you couldn't program in a bridge? What, you think the bridge was too dangerous, like it was going into seesaw territory? But this, that sidewalk could be used as a seesaw. I don't know. Yeah, I'll just bow ask the maskist to go get it. He just loves being bossed around. Hey, Luigi. Suichi, go get the signboard. Huh? What me? Jeez. Yes, go get the signboard. Why? Huh? Hmm. Yeah, yeah, you're a tonal masochist. Huh? huh? Wait a minute. Do they all think that about me? <laughs> just to make you feel special, I want you to get it while you crawl like a dog. Uh, um... No, I'll walk normally. Thank you. This is Dimor, it says Mariah Hills. Oh, sorry. Sorry about that. I just need to grab this and head back to the others. <laughs> just rams me you. Boom. Piece of shit. Hey, I thought I told you to crawl like a dog. No. You actually told me I'd be on all You actually thought I'd be on all fours. <laughs> Whatever, quit wasting your time and lay the signboard across the river. Alright then. Sure. See, it fit perfectly. We now have ourselves a bridge. I'm gonna walk over this shabby looking signboard. It's definitely gonna break. Fucking your brain must be smaller than your tits. I told you, I've been still breaking this world. I see. Oh, so even this crappy signboard can be a sturdy bridge in this world, huh? Listen up! This signboard is the only bridge we got, so don't go effing it up and, and let it wash it away. If the signboard gets washed away be by the river, we won't have a bridge anymore. Stop it. Alright, jeez, you're so annoying. Oh? Ha! Huh? There's a bridge! Ah, thank God! I gave up when I realized I had no way to cross the river. Where were you, and what were you playing? And what were you doing? Oh, I was in the forest over there, looking for the secret to the outside world. But unfortunately, I couldn't find it. Well, I wasn't expecting it to be as easy, anyways. Right, Gonta? Mm, yeah. <laughs> Perfect. It's way more convenient when we're all together, anyways. Mm -hmm. Huh? What do you mean convenient? N nothing. Uh, whatever. Let's just cross the river. Get over here, guys! It's too late to be dead back now, okay? Cool, can speed things up. Yeah, that was stressful. I just wanna make sure I wasn't doing it. Yeah, that was stressful, but the thing about objects not breaking was true. No. That's what I've been saying! Hey. Aren't we just beyond the wavy line drawn on the map? Ah. You'll find out if you keep going forward. Why don't you go check it out? That's disconcerting. I want to check out what's down here. So it's like a loading screen. Huh? What was that? What was that? What just happened? For a second, it felt like I lost consciousness. Everything went black, and now here I am. No. Nope. That didn't happen to our bias, but it happened to this world. Huh? What do you mean? But... But that is an accurate description. As if the world itself switched over... You're right! Could it be loading? <laughs> Correct, I mean, uh, erect! <laughs> um, you said the right word the first time! That being said... Anyways, four eyes is right. You all just passed through the map loading point. You know... In some games, if you go into a building, it'll take a moment for the inside to fully load. Well, the outside is like that too, because the virtual world is divided into two large maps. The wavy line represents where the two maps meet. Think of these two maps as if they're two different rooms. In the same way, you have to go through a door to move between two rooms. To move between two maps, you got to pass through the map loading point. Then... Is this why we can't see past the point on the binoculars on the roof? Ah. Obviously, you can't see what's inside one room when you're standing inside the other. Oh, oh a map loading point! Fun. 
say not only does your psychic off, but sound cuts off too. Ah. Yeah, you can't hear anything all the at all while you're inside the map loading point. So no sound goes through either. Right. Shut the chapels over there! Right, well I'm going to go ahead then! Hey. hey, don't go on ahead! I don't trust you being alone by yourself! Plays with Ganta! It's because you pay attention and that you're more likely to be tricked. I want to explore! I like exploring! There's snow... And more snow... And more snow... And the chapel... Anything behind the chapel? Mana coins! <gasps> so is this the secret of the outside world? You earn seven mana coins. Yay. Exploration pays off! Okay, let's go inside the chapel. This is the chapel! It's a mess, huh? Yeah, searching this place is gonna be pretty hard. Booyah! Now that we checked all the most Ah, oh, sorry. Now that we checked out all the most important places in the virtual world. Listen up! Let's stop and look for the secret of the outside world. So ah, so I'm spreading up, huh? That's really better. I wonder what the secret of the outside world could be. Monokuma did not give us much information about it either. Excellent. Are we gonna be able to find it if we don't know where it is? As I avoided asking whether we'd find it or not, then we just got to do it! Ah. Yeah, that's right! Just keep an eye out for anything suspicious that it's bound to turn up! Hmm. It sounds like we have a difficult task ahead of us, but I guess we have to see it through. Ah. Oh yeah, before we speed it up, I want to ask you something, Miu. Two weekends exist here! What are you doing whispering about? Piece of shit. Mind your business, Titless. Quit stick sticking your pot belly where it doesn't belong. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't have a pot belly. I definitely don't have a pot belly. Uh, but you're not denying that first part. Well. So, who's going to decide how we split up? Leave it to me. Just leave it to me. I'll figure out how everyone should be split in a flash. W wait. Now, now, hold up. I'll decide that. I know this is what better than any of you, so I'll decide. Uh-oh, uh -oh, are you sure? Sure. Kaido, I want you to set the rooftop of the mansion. What? Huh? Where do I gotta go up the rooftop? It's freaking cold out there. Hmm. Yeah, there's no way the faint-hearted Kaido can set in the cold. All right. All right, bring it on. All I gotta do is search the rooftop, right? I and Kokichi really don't seem to get along. Well then. Kokichi, you're in charge of the salon. Okay. Okay, got it. Hmm. We need we need about three more people to search the mansion. Doesn't matter who. This is uh, this plane became pretty sl this plane became pretty sloppy all of a sudden. Oh, I see. Then go and you come with me. We can set the matching surroundings. Is there anyone else who wants to deal with the cold? Mm. Okay, go to come with you. Yeah. Uh huh. A true gentleman must always volunteer to do the daddy work. Oh, wow. oh so you're going to use go again? I decided. I'm not going. I'm going to going that way too. I have to make sure you're not abusing poor Gonta. All right. We need one more person for entry. So would you come with us? Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Is Maki upset? Because she's all by herself now. The Swendra is coming out. If I ask her, I suspect she would just ask me if I wanted to die again. Is she quiet now? Booyah! All right, everyone else, stick with me and in, in, in the chapel and look for secrets. I understand. So Himiko, Maki, Mew, and myself understood. All right. Let's go back. Let's go back to the mansion. We gotta find the secret of the outside world. Maki roll. Do a good job, Maki roll. Hey, so. Hey, is Maki roll mad? Switch. Did you do something? Uh, I don't know. I. I suppose it makes sense for our chapel to have an organ. Kai probably could have played the organ well too. Sure is messy here. There's a lot of books and posters and what looks like Christmas decorations. Was this meant to hide the secret of the outside world? That's something Monokuma would do. Leave it to me. Suichi, we'll take care of searching around the chapel. I will show you that I'm leagues apart from those household cleaning robots. Uh, okay, I'll leave the chapel to you, Kibo. 
this year, the amount of books, Christmas decorations. Yeah, I'm already tired. Oh, if you press the L button, you can take the text box away. Pretty cool. Yeah, I'm already tired. Luigi, if you want to help, don't go back, okay? No. I was just taking a look around. I'll go investigate the mansion. Went we'll back to the mansion, we'll do little things there, and then basically everything's good. Oh, darn it! I'm trying to move things. Okay, sorry, sorry about that. Did everyone cross the bridge? Okay then, let's head to the mansion together. Whoops, my hand slipped. Mew! What are you doing? Aww. I just can't even see you guys off, and my hand accidentally slipped. Yeah, Mew! Your hand slipped! Oh gosh, she's trying to kill she's trying to kill us all off! Don't screw around! That was obviously on purpose! It, it wasn't on purpose at all. It, it was an accident. You can talk crap like that. You only ever attract ugly bees. Like you. <laughs> Do you, you want to spend the rest of your life around by ugly bees, dumbass? Well, I'm already surrounded by you, so that's a smashing start. <laughs> that wasn't even an insult. I'm famous for attracting ugly people. I can't believe Kokichi didn't have a line for that. Uh, uh, what are they fighting about? I've met a lot of people up to now, but I do have someone so messed up. Shit! Seriously, that guy is so much trouble! I'm sorry. Oh, sorry! There was one more person here. But what are the people in the chapel going, chapel going to do? Now they have no way to get across. Oh, you're right! You can only log off from the salon in the mansion! Well, maybe Mew can fix it later! Let's just get to the mansion already! We have to deal with them later. First, we gotta find the secret of the outside world. The secret of the outside world. I can't imagine what it could be. All I can do is hope that it means a way out. I'm curious. Let's keep going. Okay. I know, I'm just a curious guy. Keep on gonna check the mansion surroundings and rooftop. I'll go to the salon so you can plan so you can talk in the plane bass and move your Suichi. You can go plainly search the dining hall in the kitchen. Sorry, Sorry Suichi, it's my fault you got paired with me. Hey, but everyone knows that the plane pair is just plain dangerous. Uh, I don't know about that. Um, got to go now. Uh, it's surprisingly cold out there, so be careful. You should go back here to warm up. It's okay. Thank you, but Gonta okay. Gonta not smart enough to get sick. Come on. Someone who isn't smart wouldn't want to save everyone. They'd only think of themselves. Mm. Oh, thank you. Hey. Okay, let's stop the full chit and chit chat and get back to looking for the secret of the outside world. But we don't know what's waiting for us, so we got to be very careful, okay? All right, let's start. We'll start searching too. All right. Yeah, I want to hurry find the secret of the outside world so we can get back. I want to go back to my real body. Well, these avatars aren't that bad, you know. Huh? huh? These avatars. Just kidding. It's just a joke. I'm just joking. I'm gonna check out the rooftop. You guys better not slack off. Going to. Going to go now too. Hey, Suichi, we should go too. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Okay. I think we'll do that. Take care of that in the next episode. Anyways, I really appreciate that you stuck around to watch this episode. You're a great viewer. I hope you come back for the next one. If you like this video, like, subscribe, comment, show it to where's that you want it. With that, I'll see you later. Bye.